Hey, good Saturday morning. We do have a few showers and thunderstorms in the forecast today and Sunday. I'll help to guide you around those raindrops. Let's start with the tropics, though. We still have this little unorganized tropical disturbance that will cross over South Florida today, moving to the southwestern Atlantic Ocean. No concern for us here locally. It could still be named, but if it is, the chances are better. It's in the uh, Atlantic Ocean. Tropical storm warnings in place for South Florida. There was a deluge of rain close to Miami. Some localized street flooding there and street flooding about the biggest concern with this is some of these locations continue to have these waves of rain move over and across South Florida. For us, coastal Georgia and the low country, a few passing clouds this morning, some sunshine mixed in. And then during the afternoon, that's when our shower and thunderstorm chances will be highest. Little sun glare on the camera lens right now, our Hotel Tybee camera. I noticed a couple people out there trying to get that perfect sunrise shot. That's pretty early to wake up on a Saturday morning. You're probably in bed right now with the TV on, so let's get you ready for your outdoor plans a little bit later on today. Some sunshine this morning, midday, already either side of 80 degrees across our area. And then during the afternoon, that's when you definitely want to keep an umbrella on standby. We'll have a few showers and thunderstorms. If you're caught under one, there will be some of those tropical downpours once again. And if you hear the thunder start to rumble, time to head inside and make sure the kids are as well. Let's look now at rain timing. This is this morning, just a few clouds in the mix, some pockets of sunshine by 1 to 3 p.m. That's when we'll start to see showers and thunderstorms develop across the area. And I mentioned some locally heavy downpours. Those could really just be scattered, isolated anywhere across our area. 8, 9, 10 p.m., a lot of the rain starts to diminish. And Sunday's forecast does look a little better, especially if you're west of I-95. That tropical system stays way off the southeast coastline. It's not even very organized. And for us, just an isolated shower thunderstorm on Sunday. Sunday, we will say, is the pick day of the weekend. CityCast today, middle 80s in a lot of our backyards. Ridgeland 86, same in Savannah. 50% chance of those afternoon showers and thunderstorms. Islands forecast, a lot of low to mid 80s, a lower end chance of rain if you're right at the coastline, and that would be from the early afternoon through the late afternoon. Otherwise, the rain chances will push away from the coastline. Great event at Tanger. Outlets today in Pooler, a mix of sun and clouds for the fifth annual Love and Soul Festival during the morning. Watch out for those afternoon or early evening showers and thunderstorms, and it should be drying out once we get to about 8 p.m. Here's your certified most accurate forecast. Temperatures are down a little bit this weekend. That will include Monday as well, starting off a new work week. 90s will return, though. It's hard to keep those away this time of year. And maybe even some mid-90s getting closer to Thursday with those highs starting to climb, a few showers and thunderstorms in the mix. And that following weekend, see that there, days 8 and 9, the temperatures will start to come down just a bit, returning to the 80s. That is a look at your certified most accurate forecast. Speaking of weather, our